Tell me about the children. Dr. Halsey. You already know everything. You kidnapped them. Children's minds are more easily accepting of indoctrination. Their bodies more adaptable to augmentation. The result was the ultimate soldier. And because of our success, when the Covenant invaded, we were ready. Dr. Halsey, you're bending history for your own favor, and you know it. You developed the Spartans to crush human rebellion, not to fight the Covenant. When one human world after another fell, when my Spartans were all that stood between humanity and extinction, nobody was concerned about why they were originally built. So you feel in the end your choices were justified. My work saved the human race. Do you think the Spartans' lack of basic humanity helped? What are you after? The others before you were naval intelligence, but you... You're something else. Records show Spartans routinely exhibited mildly sociopathic tendencies. Difficulty with socialization and The records show efficient behavior operating in hazardous situations. I supplied the tools to maintain that efficiency. Do you believe the Master Chief succeeded because he was, at his core, broken? What does John have to do with this? You want to replace him? The Master Chief is dead. His file reads, missing in action. Catherine. Spartans never die. Your mistake is seeing Spartans as military hardware. My Spartans are humanity's next step. Our destiny as a species. Do not underestimate them. But most of all, do not underestimate him. Wake up, Chief. I need 
into. For a while. Where are we? We're still adrift on the dawn. Why did you wake me? Hang on. Bringing your systems online now. I rewrote your suit firmware while you were out. You've been busy. Activating the ship's gravity generators. Hostile system Chief, look up. You need to pull the manual release. like old times. Ready to get back to work? I thought you'd never ask. We've got intrusion alerts lighting up on multiple decks. Our best bet to figure out who's boarding us is the observation deck, four floors up. Could it be a rescue team? Wouldn't bet on it. This is the service record for Spartan John 117. Would you like to continue? Frigate Pillar of Autumn discovers Forerunner Halo Installation 04 and deploys Spartan 117 to protect UNSC AI Cortana. Chief uncovers a Covenant plot to fire the weapon and sacrifices the Autumn to destroy the Halo Ring. Pursuing the Covenant flagship after an attack on Earth, Spartan 117 arrives at Halo Installation 05 to find the Covenant erupting into civil war. After preventing the Covenant from firing the ring, 117 followed them back to Earth in search of a forerunner installation that can activate all the galaxy's halos. The Covenant arrive at Earth and open a portal to the Ark an extra-galactic forerunner installation that can fire the Halo Array. Spartan 117 unites a joint Covenant-UNSC team to pursue the Covenant to the Ark, where he successfully destroys the installation and prevents the rings from being used. When Spartan 117 attempts to escape from the Ark aboard the UNSC Forward Unto Dawn, the slipspace portal that the ship is passing through collapses. Aboard the aft section of the Dawn, Spartan 117 is placed into cryosleep, pending recovery by UNSC forces. AI Cortana to remain active as long as is technically feasible. End of service record. How long was I out? Four years, seven months, ten days. Somebody should have found us by now. What's that? Sensor scan, high intensity, doesn't match any known patterns. How close are we to the observation deck? It's directly above us. The elevator doors look sealed tight. Chief, be careful. Because some areas might have lost pressure. Right. Chief, watch out! So badly. I thought we had a truce with the Covenant. A lot can happen in four years. Either way, he's probably not alone. We should be careful.
The good news is these Covenant aren't outfitted like standard military. It's possible we just came across a rogue salvage ship. Or we might have stumbled into an entire Covenant fleet. Maybe they haven't recognized us. That's one possibility. Landing craft flanking us! Bigger problems. We've got a cruiser on an intercept course. Head for the elevator banks. Didn't the ship's sensors say we still had weapon systems online? Yes, but since the ship was torn in half, we can't access the weapon stations. We'll have to fire them manually from the outer hull. Down. Assuming they don't raise them, that missile's gonna be one heck of a surprise! These Covenants seem more fanatical than the ones we fought before. We're just about there. The auxiliary launch station should be to your left, out of the airlocks. You'll have to prime the launch for ignition! Cortana! It's nothing. Just get to the launch station. Uh, I'm sorry, did I miss orbiting a Forerunner planet at some point? One thing at a time. Vehicle bay. I'm tagging the 
Closest airlock. Go! Where are we? Checking coordinate impact data. We have asked you to give up your family, your childhood, your future. Cortana. I'm sorry. It's the crash. I'm fine. Something was wrong even before we left the dawn. Chief? Really? I'm fine. Cortana. I was put into service eight years ago. Eight years. AIs deteriorate after seven, Chief. Halsey. Chief. We need to find Halsey. Chief, please. She made you. She can fix you. I won't recover from rampancy, Chief. If we can just get back to Earth and find Halsey, she can fix this. Don't. Make a girl a promise you can't keep. We need to move. Doesn't look like the Covenant fared much better than we did. How many ships made it through the roof? Plenty. Why? We still need to ride home. The interesting factor here isn't that H1 disabled the viral termination code I implanted in her matrix. These metrics imply its success wasn't just unlikely, but that even the accepted seven-year life cycle estimates may not apply. Thus far, I've determined that the unique circumstances of her creation have triggered what I can only refer to as a recessive variant in the AI seed. As her architect, I'm currently at a loss as to the origin of this rogue element. Very curious. I'm picking up a faint transmission on the high band. Covenant? I don't think so. The pattern's different. I'll try to triangulate its position.
warthogs and still in one piece. Nice to see your luck is holding out. Chief? About my condition? I didn't want to mention it, seeing as how it's a complete long shot, but since you brought it up, it is possible that getting home could help me find a solution for my rampancy. How? Well, as far as I know, I'm the only AI ever generated from living tissue. A clone of Dr. Halsey, to be precise. It may be possible to recompile my neural net by replicating those same conditions. But that means getting back to Halsey soon. Chief, several patrols just reported in outside that structure over the ridge. It's possible they're onto something. hijack a ship from these Covenant, we're going to have to find where they're landing first. I don't suppose you have a plan for that. We could always ask nicely. Asking's not my strong suit. That elite dropped his camo module. Let's have a look. I'll run a soft patch to it from the suit. Never know what might come in handy. It's a localized site cartographer. Hmm. Okay. In service of Forerunner Shield World, designate Requiem. Requiem? At least we know where we are now. Let's see if it can tell us what the Covenant are so interested in. Huh. What happened? I don't know. It locked up. I'm detecting power fluctuations in several locations. I'll put them up for you. Hopefully we can find some way to get this cartographer back online. What's it doing? It's all right. This energy is actually a ferroelectric data field. Your shields are just cycling in response to the chamber's charge. Will this bring the cartographer back online? Partially. This type of processing system usually works in parallel. We'll have to locate its twin. Is that the same signal? Yes! Mayday, Mayday, Mayday! UNSC AI Cortana to infinity, please respond! No response. But from the strength of that signal, the infinity has to be close by. The cartographer should be back online. We may be able to use it to track the ship's location. Covenant access to the cartographer. Clear them out. The cartographer keeps acting like the transmission is coming from everywhere on the planet at once. It doesn't want to triangulate Infinity's signal. But wait, I got it. That can't be right. Scan again. We've already passed through one layer of the planet's surface. It's not crazy to think that someone else made it deeper inside than we did. You mean the planet's hollow? 
Let me see if I can figure out a way to reach these coordinates that doesn't involve us digging a really big hole. There's a terminus on the far side of the complex. We can portal to the planet's core from there. What? I don't know. If we have a shot at getting you back to infinity, we're taking it. Get to that terminus and find Infinity. What do you know about Infinity? Not much. She was supposed to be massive, but the project was only in prototype when we left. Chief, the Covenant Net's going crazy. They're ordering all units to converge on the tower. I guess we got their attention. We're about to have our hands full. The elites just issued a general order. They're moving all ground teams to secure the tower entrance above us. The Sentinels are trying to keep the Covenant out. While you were busy, I managed to clear up another transmission from Infinity. Sounded like he said, artifact. I wonder if it's related to whatever the Covenant are after. Where's the Terminus? The map placed it at the top of the tower. This node is caught in a loop trying to access something it's calling the Domain. An off-world data repository of some kind, though I'm only able to extract bits and pieces of the complete exchange. I'll log it for investigation later. Cathedral, this terminus is just one node of a larger transit grid that spans the entire planet. What? When I tried to access the outlet closest to Infinity's transmissions, the system responded with this. What is it? That's the kicker. It's the forerunner symbol for Reclaimer. Humanity. That's got to be Infinity. Can you get us to those coordinates? Let me try to open a portal. Cortana. I'm picking up unknown energy signatures. Where? This can't be right. Set a waypoint out of the tower. Cortana. How did... Quick! Into the portal! Chief, go! What were those things? Some sort of advanced defense AIs. Related to the Sentinels, I'm guessing, but it's hard to say without a closer look. Come on, let's figure out where that transit system dumped us.
Where's Infinity? This is Requiem's core, all right. But Infinity is definitely not here. That satellite in the center is amplifying the ship's broadcasts like a relay. Maybe we can use it to respond. Perhaps. Those beams coming off it are creating the interference we've been experiencing. We'd have to take them out to contact Infinity. Can you get us there? Opening a gate to the first beam pylon. Pull me, and let's go. This is the first pylon? Negative. This is as close as I could get us. Hope you don't mind hoofing it a little. Contacts! Those weren't the same things we saw in the terminus. Similar cortical footprint as the tower AIs. They're connected, all right. Ray of sunshine, isn't he? From that peak under the hood, I'd say these constructs must be mimetic in nature. The relay interference is increasing. We must be getting close to the pylon. that distortion that's me something about moving through those portals is increasing the load on my systems are you gonna be all right don't worry I've held off rampancy this long haven't I The entrance is shielded. Let's figure out how to take it down. Chief, look at this. That's Requiem! They're not inside at all. They're moving into orbit. Say forward unto dawn. They must have intercepted our distress beacon. The beacon was pulled into Requiem with us. If they try to follow it... They'll get caught in the gravity well. I'll keep trying to warn them. You just get that beam down. Starting to clear up. Wait, Tom Axel. We detected a UNSC beacon coming from somewhere inside the planet. They haven't hit the gravity well yet. There's still too much interference to warn them. 
We've got to disable that other beam before they're pulled in like we were. I was wondering why Infinity hadn't encountered the Covenant yet. What are they doing here? They're heading to the second pylon as well. That can't be a coincidence. Sounds like the Prometheans don't want the Covenant here either. The battle net's already lighting up with reports of resistance all around the pylon. down. Shields weak. Still online. Take out the other two power cores and you can access the pylon. Good job, Chief. UNSC Infinity Survivor 400. Reading a fake ISS tag near the planetary core. Do you read? The planet's core? They know we're here. Infinity, this is UNSC AI Cortana. Do not approach Forerunner Planet. Repeat, do not UNSC approach... UNSC Asset. Ford unto dawn. We read you, but you're breaking up. Help. Increase speed by 27. Get us in there. Negative, Infinity! Do not enter the planet! If you can hear us, keep transmitting. No! Chief, you've got to get that beam down now! Not strong enough. Move us up to the relay satellite. Already done. Go. Once we're on the satellite, there's bound to be a central control point. The Covenant are moving towards the relay too. This doesn't make any sense. Why would they care about a broadcast relay? I'll handle them. You just find us that control node. I'll see until Infinity hits the gravity well. A minute or two max. The Covenant are making a push for something on the far side of the satellite. Chief, you need to hear this! We're detecting a slight gravimetric disturbance near the planetary entrance. Suggest altering approach vector 43K-750K-12K. They're not diverting from the opening! Hurry, Chief!
We don't have time. The pillars! Touch the pillars! Infinity, this is Sierra 117 of the UNSC Forward Unto Dawn. Do you copy? Infinity. Infinity, do you read? Chief? Chief, let go of the contacts. Find us an exit. Don't wait around on my account! Recognize what you were oblivious to, human. Your nobility has blinded you, as ever. The librarian left little to chance, didn't she? Turning my own guardians, my own world, against me. But what hubris. She could protect her pets from me forever. If you haven't mastered even these primitives, then man has not attained the matter. Your ascendance may yet be prevented. Time was your ally, human. But now it has abandoned. Foreigners have returned. This tomb is now yours. Slip space rupture! Chief!
Infinity. Unknown entity has seized control of our ship. We're without power. We're on a collision course with an unidentified Forerunner planet. Track its descent. Marking. Impact predicted 77.8 kilometers due north. You know where he's heading. Same place we are. Stay low. Recon sortie heading this way. The ship looks intact. Something tells me that's only because the Didact wanted it that way. This is Lasky to UNSC Infinity. We're up to an exit bad guys down here. Does anyone read? This is Sierra 117 of the UNSC Forward Under Dawn. We're on station, ready to assist. Negative copy. Sounds like you said Forward Under Dawn coming in. Signals bouncing in and out. I can't clean it up. Light up their friend or foe tags. We're gonna need something to zero in on. I'm seeing numerous IFF tags. Painting the closest one on your phone. Must not have received his distress call. I've got another IFF tag. But as far as I can tell, we're moving into a choke point. This may end up as a dead end. That's the friend or foe tag, but where's whoever it belongs to? Multiple IDs! Chief, they're friendlies! I'm afraid we're gonna have to give you an IOU on that welcome home party. Tom Lasky, first officer of the Infinity. Never thought I'd see you again. Seal her up! I thought you'd be taller. Ground forces are ordered to return to Infinity immediately. Commander, radio's hot! Infinity, this is Commander Lasky. The Helkin recon teams are down. Repeat, all birds are down. We got numerous casualties and require immediate assistance. Over. Final. Did you get the coordinates of that gravity well? Affirmative, sir, but we're gonna need a bus out of here. Make it happen. You were sent on a scouting run in the middle of an attack on the ship. The captain thought Infinity could provide us cover and hold off the attack at the same time. Sir, we'll never get the wounded back to the ship on foot. I don't know if it's too soon to ask you for a favor, but we're gonna run out of breathing room here real quick. 
I don't suppose you're any good at clearing LZs. On occasion. I'll send out an all clear once the area is secured. A topographical scan of the area shows a break in the foliage north of here. Should be big enough to bring in a dropship for evac. Chief, it's Lasky. We're getting reports of friendlies pinned down near your position. Can you assist? Commander, this is Cortana. We're on our way. Trying to get through these doors. Look for an interface. Sorry about back there. That hatch of security was more difficult than I expected. It's all right. It's not all right. Nothing about it is all right. Knight! Wait, what's he doing? Covenant? They're working with the Prometheans? Cortana to Lasky. LZ is secured. Roger that, Cortana. I'll give you the coordinates. Mayday! Mayday! Code red! Hostile elements attempting to gain entrance to the Infinity Bridge. They're outside the hatch! Doors breach! Doors breach! All units return to Infinity immediately. That's an order! Chief! Redirecting the Spartan Force to Rally Point Alpha Sierra Foxtrot. Until we catch up, you have tactical command of the forward assault force. Run in with those men and take back that ship. Yes, sir. Good luck, Chief. Lasky out. This is Pelican 595. We have the Chief on board and are outbound for Rally Point Alpha Sierra Foxtrot. Weapons free, Chief. Let him have it! We're good to go, Chief. Let's show these Spartans how it's done. Sir, what's our status? That satellite took down the ship's defenses and is extracting data from the ship's mainframes as we speak. Can we break the connection? Main point of contact's on the ship's upper hull. The fastest route is through the maintenance causeway. There's a Mantis docked inside the door. Take it. You'll need the extra firepower.
how they're blocking the Infinity's defenses. Exactly what we were thinking. Neutralize them so we can get our guns back online and show that satellite we're more than just a big paperweight. We're on it, Commander. Cortana out. Didact's not letting go without a fight. Hold them off. A few more minutes. those things come from it's possible that they're native to requiem or whatever counts as native for a forerunner ai we've never seen this type of offensive reaction from any of the other installations other installations mr lasky infinity's mission has been to locate the remaining halo rings and establish permanent bases to study them for decommission we got locations up and running around installations five and three but Lately, they've run into some setbacks. A science team got zapped excavating a Forerunner artifact. This sensor data is all that was left. Interesting. These symbols are a derivation of the Forerunner glyph system. And our geeks managed to pull some coordinates. I'll give you three guesses where it led. Sir, Gypsy Company is prepped and ready to roll on your orders. Thank you, Palmer. Mr. Lasky, you take point. I want boots on the ground in 60. Captain. This is a first contact scenario, Master Chief. Priority is to free Infinity from Requiem's gravity well and file a threat assessment back at Fleetcom. You mean we're leaving? Sir, Infinity drove the Didact back. He's vulnerable. He isn't the only one. You know, I think you, of all people, would appreciate the benefit of living to fight another day. Infinity to Gypsy Company? The air corridor to the gravity well is blocked by a network of particle cannons. Infinity shields are still down. Open the lane for us to move up and provide air support. Captain, what's Force Recon's assessment of the terrain? I know you've been off the field for a while, Master Chief, but this is a blow-through op. Sending in a recon would just slow us down. Telemetry indicates the particle cannons are being controlled from a command post southwest of our position. Roll on that target and neutralize those guns. We'll meet on the other side and take the gravity well. Infinity out. I don't know about you, but I usually like a little more intel with my intel. We'll make it work. Chief, Spartan Sarah Palmer in Infinity CIC. Commander Lasky's waiting for you on the Mammoth. On our way. Well, someone's overcompensating. Papa Foxtrot 766 to Spartan Palmer. We're finally in the air.
Chief. Unfortunately for us, we've got to manually bring down a couple of particle cannons before we can get to the command post. Chief, Palmer again. The Mammoth's got jetpacks on board. If I were down there, I'd want one. Captain Del Rio, targeting Pelicans are in position near the particle cannons, waiting for the Mammoth's Minimac to take them out. 766, lose some altitude. You're inside the kill box. Almost got target lock. Just a little more. Pelican, fall back. Infinity! Pelican's down! Get to the crash site and retrieve that target designator, Gypsy. You've got no chance of clearing those guns without it. All teams, we've got Covenant squads digging in on the base line. Target those phantoms for the railgun to shoot down. Target fire! Railgun reloaded. All right, Master Chief, we're clear. Minimax at your disposal. Take out that particle cannon. Gypsy, let's move! Shadow Company, Castle Company. Put some pressure on those other particle cannons. Castle, reading 555. On station, ready to assist. Shadow Actual to Infinity, encountering enemy air. Significant EOF closer to the emplacements. Alright, seal her up. Mammoth is mobile. Hold it together, okay. Chief, do you even understand what rampancy is? Really? We don't just shut down. Our cognitive processes begin dividing exponentially according to our total knowledge base. We literally think ourselves to death. You know I won't let that happen. And if it happens anyway? Seven, Blasky. Go here. We got significant blockage up ahead. I think this is about it for the Mammoth. The command post for the particle cannons is through that trench. Sir, I can move faster alone. We'll see you back on Infinity, Commander. Blasky out. Cortana to Infinity. We're entering the Forerunner structure. Breaking up, but coordinates received, Infinity. This 
elevator should take us directly to the coordinates Infinity provided. Almost like those Sentinels wanted us to get the Particle Cannons offline. This could be a trap. You say that like there's a second possibility? We've reached the coordinates. This looks like the place. Cannon Network must use these arrays for targeting and guidance. It's an automated system, so it won't technically allow me to redirect the cannons to fire on one another. Technically. Cortana to Infinity. The guns should be offline. How's it look from up there? Infinity! Cortana? Something's in here. Kate! Cortana. Cortana. Who are you? I am what remains of the Forerunner, once known as the Librarian. My memories were retained to assist humanity on their path to the Mantle. Though sadly, that plan is now at risk. The Didact is leaving Requiem. Soon. You must not allow it. Leaving? He seeks this. The Composer. A device which will allow him to finally contain the greatest enemy ever faced by the Forerunners. You. Mankind spread into the stars with an unexpected, desperate violence. Entire systems fell before the Didax warrior servants rose to halt the aggression. When the Didact finally exhausted the humans after a millennia, his sentence was severe. We had no way of knowing that the Forerunners were not your only enemy. Humanity hadn't been expanding. They were running. Weakened from our conflict, we were no match for the parasite which pursued you. The Forerunners made plans for a final great journey. But the Didact refused to yield our mantle of responsibility. He would save all life in the galaxy. At a cost. In the Forerunner's quest for transcendence, the Composer had been intended to bridge the organic and digital realms. It would have made us immortal. But its results soured. The stored personalities fragmented. And our attempts to return them to biological states created only abominations. Such moral concerns faded from the Didact's attention. The Flood only assimilated living tissue. The Composer would provide the Didact his solution and his revenge. The Prometheans. They're human. They were only the beginning. He would have encrypted your entire race if we had not removed the Composer from his care and imprisoned him here. Reclaimer. When I indexed mankind for repopulation, I hid seeds from the Didact. Seeds which would lead to an eventuality. Your physical evolution 
Your combat skin? Even your Ancilla Cortana? You are the culmination of a thousand lifetimes of planning. Planning for what? He has found us. Even in death, her meddling continues. Reclaimer, the gene song I placed within you contains many gifts, including an immunity to the composer. But it must be unlocked. How? Relinquish your contact essence. Your evolutionary journey must be accelerated. Can I defeat the Didact without it? No. Then do it. Prepare. Chief, what happened? Your bio-readings are all over the map. It's a long story, but I know what the Didact's after. I know that part. The Librarian filled me in when she snatched me from the system. But what I don't know is what she did to you. Seven to infinity. What's our status? We're taking a beating up here. Does infinity have a shot on the gravity well? Negative. We'll never be able to get a target well with all the air traffic we're seeing. Captain, what if we can spot the target for you with the laser designator? Do it. Take up. Find the chief coordinates for somewhere with line of sight. Infinity, we're at the gravity well. Then paint that damn target so we can get out of here. You heard it, Chief. Line up the shot. Target locked. Infinity cannot handle that kind of punishment. Not again. This isn't about us or this ship anymore. Sir, we've seen what the Didact is capable of. If we let him leave this world, humanity will be at risk. Look, I understand what you think you saw. Think? With all due respect, sir, I know what I saw. And with all due respect to you, soldier, I'm not willing to jeopardize my ship because of the hallucinations of an aging Spartan and his malfunctioning AI. Sir, what if he's right? Nav, as soon as we know we're airtight, I want a course laid into Karanay Station. Com, prepare a warning beacon. I will not! Allow you to leave this planet! Cortana. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to do that. Commander Lasky. Pursuant to Article 55 of UNSC Regulation 12 14572, I'm ordering you to remove that AI's data chip and retire it for final dispensation. I don't want to. You don't want me to. Remove Please. the chip now, Commander. Give me that chip. The didact has to be stopped. If you won't do that, I will. I am ordering you to surrender that AI! No, sir. Lieutenant! Arrest that man! Captain! Arrest him! Captain! Get word to Earth that trouble is coming. Cortana and I will do what we can back here.
I can give you over 40,000 reasons why I know that sun isn't real. I know it because the emitter's Rayleigh effect is disproportionate to its suggested size. I know it because its stellar cycle is more symmetrical than that of an actual star. But for all that, I'll never actually know if it looks real. If it feels real. Before this is all over, promise me you'll figure out which one of us is the machine. So what's your plan? Infinity's tracked the Didax vessel to a docking structure southeast of here. We'll jump ship as Infinity exits the roof. You know, I was sent down here with orders to prevent you from leaving. In case you'd already gone, I took the precaution of ordering a Pelican. Outfitted for full combat pursuit. I hope to God you're wrong about that Forerunner. Or whatever he is, Chief. But in the vent, you're not. Chief, good luck. Both of you. Come on, Chief. Take a girl for a ride. The Didact used this composer to create the Prometheans from ancient humans. If he wants to finish the job, he'll have to find it first. Our best bet to stop him is keep him firmly on Requiem. Let's hope Lasky didn't skimp on that pelican. Nice timing, Chief. back out there initiating pre-flight diagnostics forward auto cannon check lateral rail turrets check main thrusters check auxiliary boosters check all right keying engine it may be a while before we find another ride home you know that right it'll be okay Didact, dead ahead. How do we get inside those shields? Marking two of the larger facilities on your HUD. They're acting as traffic control for resources moving to and from the satellite. If we disrupt their communications, I can forge an override code and convince it to lower those defenses. Towers directing traffic to the Didact satellite through a carrier wave generator located somewhere inside. Of course, if Infinity wasn't on its way back to Earth, locating and disabling it would be trivial. We can handle it. That's hardly the point, is it? I found the carrier wave generator. It's on the opposite end of this chamber. We can use this gondola to cross to the other side. Find the activation switch. out of our old playbook, I'm going to tune your shields to emit an EMP at the same frequency as the communication network. All you'll need to do to trigger it is to make physical contact with the carrier wave generator. Taking fire, starboard side! Why 
finally stop him. They've over the gondola control. Light up the override on the HUD. Cortana, the override. Here. Okay, the lockout has been released, but... On the platform, that's the carrier wave generator. Enter the carrier field to trigger the suit's EMP. Communications from this tower have ceased. The mantle of responsibility for the galaxy shelters all of you. But only the forerunners are its masters. Cortana, where's this coming from? Where's what coming from? The Didact's voice. I'm not picking up anything, Chief. He's there. Keep trying. There's a lot more comm traffic passing through this tower than just what's servicing the Didact satellite. These systems use data attenuators to regulate the flow of communications. Destroying those would drown out the tower's transmissions. The tower's instructions to the Didact shield would be drowned in noise. You are a fool. Even now, your kind tinkers with the composer in the shadow of the third ring. Children in Success. The system's overloading. I don't think we'll be having any more trouble from those shields. Do you truly believe these theatrics can prevent my departure? Embrace your sad fate and retain your nobility. I am already beyond you. He knows what we're trying to do. If we try to get too close to that ship, we're dead. I... I have an idea. Head for that waypoint. Quick, let me at the fire controls. Tapping into this fire central net. They're mine. Now to imprison them! What are you doing? Like Dr. Halsey imprisoned me! Chief? His ship's online. Chief, They're leaving. I I'm sorry. I don't know what... Track those lichies. We can go across them to get to the Didact ship. Wait. Across them? Yes. Um, there... There are several liches moving in formation towards the Didact ship. We're only going to have one shot at this. Okay. Go! Tana, what's happening? I don't know. Hang on!
No time. Tana. Still here. A halo? Installation 3. It's where Infinity found the coordinates for Requiem. Then why are they bypassing it? Because the Composer's not on the ring. What are you waiting for? That station's not gonna save itself. This is UNSC Master Chief to base. Do you read? Yes, I read you. This is Sandy Tilson of Ivanov Station. We're under attack. They're after a Forerunner artifact you took from the Halo Ring. How do you know about that? Doctor, I need you to protect that artifact until we arrive. Send whatever... Do you know what that condescending bitch said to me after our first game of chess? Cortana. Even I don't call it by name anymore. Correct your approach. Yes, well, he also said he works better alone. I can see why you chose him, Catherine. Cortana. I'm your greatest achievement, you detest Pull up. Now! I'm sorry. I just can't stop them. It's like a thousand of me arguing all at once. Dr. Tilson, are you there? God. When your signal cut off, I Doctor, didn't... listen to me. You have to issue the order to evacuate the station. We've been trying. The Covenant, they've already taken over the landing bays. Send me your coordinates. I'll see what I can do about clearing an evac route on my way to you. What can we do to keep the Covenant out? A harbor vessel control can erect a barricade over the bay. We're lost. Dr. Tilson, Base 7 is secure and we're moving toward your position now. Really? That's incredible! Thank you. Controls. Tilson's inside the door over there. I desperately hope you know why all this is happening. Because to be honest, my objectivity isn't doing me a whole lot of good right now. 
Hold on. I'll start us down. The device you recovered was a Forerunner weapon. The commander of that ship wants it back. Wants it back? You don't think you can remove... It can't leave the station. You know that, right? We don't have any choice, Doctor. It's not a matter of choice. It took three months, and, and the biggest starship the UNSC could throw at it just to relocate it here. Unless you're a lot stronger than you look. It's not going anywhere. Can you give Cortana access to the station's supply manifest? What for? If we can't move the Composer, we have to make sure the Didact can't either. Oh, wait. We have years of work invested here. Inventory lists seven excavation-grade Havoc mines. Just one of those would turn this base into a pinata. I'm sorry, Doctor. Keep routing your people to the evac centers. Once we take care of the Composer, you won't have much time. I'll... Make sure the nukes are primed so you can... detonate them remotely. Maybe next time you rescue us? You can give us more time to pack? Next time. with outer turrets. If we can reactivate them, I can program the station's defenses to provide cover for the evacuation. Okay, okay, I'll send you the coordinates. I thought you were the Mantis expert. I know how to use it to haul cargo. Not shoot covers. The watch commander said he was sending someone down who knew how to use the weapons on these things. <laughs> Dr. Tilson, are you there? I'm here. Any luck? Cortana's bringing the defense grid online now. Okay. That's it. I hear it. We'll broadcast the final evac orders. The nuke? We're rigging it now. Meet us back on the upper platform and we'll help you get it to the artifact. this off and actually get back to Halsey? Thank you.
Dr. Tilson. The composer's location's compromised. You've got to get that nuke down here. It, it's not ready yet. Ready or not, I need it now. Dr. Tilson, where's the warning? Dr. Tilson. Head back to the elevator platform. I'll keep trying to raise her. Cargo bays. Start us up. Status on the rest of the station. I can't believe you did that. Cortana, I need that info. <sighs> Look, don't think about the didact. Don't think about the composer. Only focus on finding me, Tilson. Tilson. Sandra K. Female, 51 years, years of age. age. Doctor of Archaeology, Pagasi Institute. Biosignature stable on 350 level. B deck. Thank you, Cortana. They've compromised the station's hull. The Didact's taken the composer. Get these people to the evac centers. Taken? Taken how? Tap the flight deck. Find us something that can carry a payload. Wait. Something's happening. Cortana, can you access the station's defense systems? They're not responding. Cortana! Jeez! It's... Are you okay? I monitored the data pulse. I could hear them. What was left of them? We need to move. These people are gone. 
and more will follow if the Didad reaches Earth. They'll pair you with another AI. Maybe even another Cortana model if Halsey lets them. That's not going to happen. It won't be me. You know that, right? Spinning up a broadsword in Hangar C-11. Whatever the Librarian did to you obviously worked. Cortana. It's not over. Not yet. Not yet. Approaching the Didact ship in 200 kilometers. Once we get on board, we'll find the bridge. He's on the move again. The fighter's shields aren't rated for slip space. No, but the Didacts are. Broadsword's hull integrity is stable. We'll be safe as long as we stay below the Didact shields. Where's the composer? Close. I should be able to guide us to it. Locking on to his transmission. He's not the composer. We can take them both out at once. Take too kindly to his abandoning you on Requiem. I'm afraid I'll have to do. 
Didact's got the composer. We're in a bronze sword carrying a havoc grade payload. On approach to deliver. See if we can grease the wheels for you. All ships, prepare to engage. All your ships to the composer. Copy that, Chief. Orbital Defense Command, this is Recon. Hostile inbound. Proceed to condition red. This is Earth Orbital Defense. Night defense is ineffective against enemy vessel. It's still approaching. the last one. Infinity, you're clear. Roger that, Chief. You might want to back up a little. Main battery, fire! Clean hit. We're proceeding to insertion. Acknowledged. We'll be on station if you need us. Make sure you give the didact our regards. Infinity out. Now what do we do? Plan B. have to deploy the warhead manually. How and where? I always know what to do. I always know what to do. Just give me a second. Keep scanning for the composer. We'll figure it out on the way. Where reason does not stop you, perhaps force can at least delay. I detected an energy signature ahead. I think it's a transit system like on Requiem. Find a way to access it. I'll try to route us to the composer. Put me in the system. Is this the secret you've kept for me? This divine excellence. Contact knows I'm in the system. Hurry, go! Portal! I sense your malfunctioning companion. And yet, she eludes me. How do we get over there? Conveyor lift! End of the ramp! 
If we time it right, our momentum should carry us through the low gravity. Chief, Chief. once that warhead is primed, the window for getting out of here is going to be pretty slow. Something you're not going to like. What did you just do? I ejected my rampant personality spikes into the system. If I do that in each of those beams, the copies can overwhelm the composer's shielding.
Humanity's imprisonment is a kindness. In that case, you won't mind if we return the favor. Your compassion for mankind is misplaced. I'm not doing this for mankind. Cortana. Cortana, do you read? Cortana, come in. the strangest thing you've seen all day? But if we're here... It worked. You did it. Just like you always do. So how do we get out of here? I'm not coming with you this time. What? Most of me is down there. I only held enough back to get you off the ship. No. That's not... We go together. It's already done. I am not leaving you here. John. I've waited so long to do that. It was my job to take care of you. We were supposed to take care of each other. And we did. Cortana, please. Wait.
actual? Pelican 9-6-er. We found him. Mind if I join you? Of course not, sir. At ease, Chief. Feels kinda odd for you to call me sir. Beautiful, isn't she? I don't get to see her often enough. I grew up in New Harmony. Attended Corbulo Military Academy. Never saw Earth in person until I was an adult, but I still think of her as home. You don't talk much, do you? Chief, I won't pretend to know how you feel. I mean, I've lost people I care about, but. Never anything like you're going through. Our duty as soldiers is to protect humanity. Whatever the cost. You say that like soldiers and humanity are two different things. I mean, soldiers aren't machines. We're just people. I'll let you have the deck to yourself. She said that to me once. About being a machine. In this hour of victory, we taste only defeat. I ask why. We are foreigners, guardians of all that exists. The roots of the galaxy have grown deep under our careful tending. Where there is life, the wisdom of our countless generations has saturated the soil. Our strength is a luminous sun towards which all intelligence blossoms and the impervious shelter beneath which it has prospered. I stand before you, accused of the sin of ensuring foreigner ascendancy, of attempting to save us from this fate where we are forced to receive. Humanity stands as the greatest threat in the galaxy. Refusing to eradicate them is a fool's gambit. We squander eons in the darkness while they seize our triumphs for their own. The mantle of responsibility for all things belongs to forerunners alone. Think of my acts as you will. But do not doubt the reality. The reclamation has already begun. <laughs> 